Two on, two out. Ten minutes. That's in the air to left. Here comes Fisher. I'm Matt Wehmeyer with the MLB.com Fastcast. The Astros are one win away from their first ever World Championship after defeating the Dodgers in an epic Game 5 of the World Series, 13-12 in 10 innings. In a back-and-forth affair, Houston came back from three different deficits before taking the lead with four runs in the seventh inning off Dodgers reliever Brandon Morrow. Two-run homer by Carlos Correa! It's 11 to 8 Astros. But the Dodgers would stun Minute Maid Park by rallying for three runs in the ninth inning. And the Dodgers have tied it at 12. This surreal game continues. But in the 10th, Alex Bregman sent everybody home with his walk-off single off Kelly Jansen, which scored pinch runner Derek Fisher from second base. Alex Bregman plays hero here in one of the most remarkable games you'll ever see. Seven home runs were hit in the game, including five by Houston. That brings the series total for both teams to 22, breaking the fall classic record from 2002. I was so happy just to help this team win. Um, I, got him on a, I got him on a slider uh, last night, so I knew he wasn't going to throw that. Looking for a cutter. Correa, all our hitting coaches, they all said, hey, you better stay on top of the cutter. Try to stay on top, and uh, we're up three to two, baby. It's ain't over yet. You know, we're going home, uh, and I don't care who we're gonna face. You know, for them, we gotta stay positive, and we can't just let you know a bad day affect us. Um, you know, they do what they're supposed to do. They take care of their home field. Um, we take one. Now we just gotta go protect it and, and, and try to win game six. And. And, and get back into it. Just when I thought I could describe game two as my favorite game of all time, I think game five uh, exceeded that and more. So I, it's hard to put into words all the, the twists and turns in that game, the emotion, doing it home in front of our home crowd. Uh, just exactly what you expect to come to the park with Keiko and Kershaw pitching. You know, just, a, just a perfect setup game for, for a bunch of runs. I think this whole series has been uh, an emotional roller coaster. It, it's um, the two best teams playing for a championship. And these are two teams that play 27 outs like we've talked about. You know, credit's all uh, you know, to our guys. Guys want to take the baseball. Guys coming up with big hits in big spots. Um, and, and that's what the World Series is all about. The World Series continues on Tuesday with Game 6. Justin Verlander takes the mound for the Astros. He will face off with Brent Chill of the Dodgers. According to reports, the Nationals have found the man to lead their team, agreeing with former Cubs bench coach Dave Martinez on a three-year deal. A veteran of a 16-year playing career, Martinez has spent the last 10 seasons as part of Joe Madden's staff with both the Rays and the Cubs. Another NL East team looks to be on the verge of filling their managerial opening as the Phillies could name Gabe Kapler as their skipper as early as Monday, according to MLB Network's John Heyman. Kapler spent 12 years as a player and has worked in the Dodgers front office the past three seasons as their director of amateur scouting. For more on these stories and for complete World Series coverage, Keep it locked in to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.